that cities are increasing in their spatial prominence and that the majority of the population is going to become urbanized relatively soon if it's not already. And, but, you know, most of um, urban land cover is not large when it comes to the absolute cover. So, for example, in the United States, only about 3% of the land area is made up of urban um, land development. But it's increasing in its prominence, and the activities that occur in urban areas are considered hot spots. And the way we manage urban landscapes for biodechemical cycling can have global implications, especially for the carbon cycle, nitrogen cycle, and water use. And um, as I mentioned, the urban population, or most of the, the population is urban. For in the United States, over 80% of our total population lives in cities or the associated um, developed land around cities. And now that's over 50% for the global population as well and that is projected to continue to increase.